Hello everyone and welcome back to Warm Robber. Today we're back at the Overall Bank Heist yet again. And today I'm going to show you a new way of completing this heist to make it a little bit easier on you. And the only tool that you'll need is a lockpick. And the skill that would really help if you have it is communication delay to add more seconds to guards' phones. So without further ado, let's get this one started. For starters, you want to grab your kit, grab your duffel bag, and grab your lockpick. From the truck, you want to head over to the side door here and unlock it with your lockpick. And leave the duffel bag outside for the time being. Once this door's open, we're going to hide underneath this camera here. And we're we'll gonna wait for this guard to come in. Once he does, shoot this camera, shoot the guard, zip tie the civilian, take the guard's phone. And now what we're gonna do is wait for this camera to move and do the check-in on the wall over there. So once it does, head over to this wall, do the check-in. Next, what we're gonna do is push the civilian outside the way we came, just around the corner so he's out of sight. Right down the stairs should be fine. Next, we're gonna grab this guard's body and do the same thing, just around the corner, out of sight, out of mind. The next step, we want to grab our lockpick, and we're going to sprint through these next two doors. Make sure you're sprinting. Head over to the security room, unlock it, leave our lockpick right here. Us sprinting through those doors should trigger our guard since he heard the noise. We're going to wait for him. Take him out. Grab his phone, do the check-in. A guard's coming down these stairs, so what we're going to do is grab this guard and drag him over with the rest of the guards. After doing so, we're going to wait for this guard down these stairs. Once he does, we're going to take him out grab his phone, head back over to the security room and do that check-in. Make sure you don't sprint through this door. Do the check-in, close the door, grab our lockpick, throw the lockpick over by the office door, because what we're going to do next is grab this guard's body that we took out earlier and drag him with the rest of the guards. Next, we're going to grab our lockpick, unlock the door to the office because we're grabbing the utility key card in here. Grab the utility key card. Make sure this camera's not looking. What we're gonna do is hide underneath it once it turns. Once it does, hide underneath it. We're gonna wait for it to turn again. Once it does, go over to the utility room and turn off the alarm. Next, we're gonna hide underneath the camera once again and wait for it to turn. Once it does, head back over here. Grab our lockpick. Grab our duffel bag. Head up these stairs. And if we're quick enough, we can actually open up this door, shoot this camera, and no guard should be alerted. And we'll be fine. But next, we're going to wait till this guard comes all the way down here. So what we're going to do is hug this corner in the hallway and just wait. Once he comes in, we're going to shoot him, take his phone, come over to this wall, do the check-in. Go over to the manager's office while we're at it. Push the civilian away. Make sure you grab the vault key card. About the way we came, put this in our duffel bag. And just to be safe, we're gonna drag this guard's body all the way down the stairs with the other bodies outside. Next, we're gonna go back up these stairs. Make sure you grab your duffel bag. To be safe, we're gonna take a meet right down this hallway, go through this office door, and we're gonna zip tie this civilian inside just to be safe. Close this door. Make sure we open up this door. Take a meet right. Outside the vault area, we're going to shoot this camera and take up all these guards in here. Grab our phones, do the check-ins on the wall. Take out this guard, grab his phone, do the check-in. Now, just to be safe, to secure an exit, what we're going to do is take a me at right. Wait for this camera to move. Take a right, open up this door. Unlock this door. There should be a guard out here. What we're going to do is wait for him to start moving, which he is. We're going to shoot this camera. Shoot him. Grab his phone. Do the check-in over here. And what we're going to do, just to be safe, is take his body. And we're going to drag him behind the building over here. Drag him over by this propane tank. Should be enough, just to be safe. We're going to go up these stairs. Make sure this door's open for future access. Grab our duffel bag. Head over to the vault, and now we can unlock this door, and we're done with the lockpick after unlocking this door. Take the vault key card, and unlock the vault door. Now all we gotta do is just loot the vault area. After looting most of the vault, we just got one more bag over there. The route we will take is take our cart. We're gonna head out the door right here. Once we get out of the vault area, head past the metal detector. We're gonna take a right. Go out this door that we came through earlier. Make sure there's no guards out here. Make sure you grab the cart, go down these stairs, 
and we're gonna go out the front of the oral bank now when we do this we're gonna go to the other side of the street because we don't want to be too close to the bank just in case a guard or a civilian spots us for example, there is a civilian in this leftmost window. He can spot you if you're too close to the building. And once we get past this taxi, we're gonna take a straight shot, take a at right, and there's the truck. Once we take in the first cart back, what we can do is go through the same door that we came in from, go up these stairs, take a right. Just to be safe, we're gonna go through this office, close this door behind us, go through here, take a at right, and now we're back in the vault area. And once we have our last bag, what we can do is do the same route, which is going out the vault area, take a at left, go through the office area, open up this door, take a at left, again, go down these stairs, take another at left, and now it's a straight shot back to the truck. We can end the heist. And as you can see, we're ending this heist with $171,000. And this was the new way of completing the overall bank heist stealthily. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe to help the channel grow. If you want to see a funny video, click the video on the left. If you want to see more war on robber videos, click the videos on the right. And like always, I hope you guys have a fantastic day, and I'll see you in the next video.